Hello, possums. Draymond Smith here. Somewhere completely different. I am in the wonderful realm of Vaston. <laughs> um, this is a world uh, owned by Fixit412 and built in by him and an amazing team of builders. It's a persistent world, so every season they move to a new kingdom and do more building. And it's all the one world, there's law, there's history. <laughs> and look at this, it's just gobsmacking. <laughs> I'm going to put a link in the description to Fix's channel. And from there you can find his videos about this place and links to all the other incredible builders. Oh, I love this observatory so much. <laughs> Every season is a new kingdom, and this season they're working on the steampunk kingdom of Cravenwall, I think. And today I'm in here working with Fix on building a steam engine. So I'll head over and wait for him, and then we'll catch up. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the realm of Vastin. Hey, you'll never guess who I'm standing beside. Well, you can because you can see it. What's up, Draymond Smith? Hey, Fix. I'm so thrilled to be here. I'm so thrilled to have you. So uh, wait till you see what we're going to build. So I've I've teased this in many episodes, uh, but here, remember these train tracks that we built a long time ago? Well, it's time to build a train. And the the perfect person is here because you have built like 10 trains on your channel here recently. No, I've built a couple and I've built rolling stock, but I've got a thing about trains. <laughs> They're and they're beautiful and they're perfect and they're oh, amazing. And so this has always you. been my plan was was before we started talking, I thought, well, I'll just follow a tutorial. It's like, what am I doing following tutorial? I'll just record it with you. Why not? This is great. So, well, I, so I, I invited... have actually designed a train just for you and just for this realm. Oh, this is perfect. So yeah, because because we had talked, you know, she said, like, well, do you want this kind and the QR12 and the and it's like I just thought a train with wheels would be nice. I don't know anything <laughs> about trains. <laughs> so so you thought like well how about a steampunk thing sort of thing because that's yep. our kingdom here and yep. so so yeah well take it away uh i have i put some resources over here and okay. um uh i i couldn't remember exactly all we needed so i just grabbed up just some stuff from our farms uh that that should be enough if we got a um stone cutter so that we can cut the prismarine yes i will i will grab one right now cool so what what kind of train here are we are we talking about before uh, we've been okay. having all kinds of audio problems so yeah, uh, we have. I, we've, I, i'm kind of hurrying because i don't yeah, know how yep. long my audio is going to hang in for yeah that's fine um i decided that as you guys have got this absolutely gobsmacking steampunk kingdom here that we'd go with something right in the heart of it so it's a train from 1870 it's a sterling 422 also known as a single <laughs> And it's from um, uh, Great Northern Railways. <laughs> yeah, don't look at me blankly. <laughs> That's so much research. I just can't, I, I can't believe, like, my total amount of research, I just kind of look down and put a block down, and <laughs> that's it, and then just go from there. So right. I, I'm, I'm looking forward to the education and, and a building. And I was kind of thinking, and this is, this is, the ball is in your court, so do what you uh -huh. want. But I was kind of thinking it would be cool to have the train, like, going across the bridge. Uh, yeah, um, the engine needs a straight yes. stretch because I've tried bending it and it doesn't uh -huh. bend in the middle. It looks like a mess. Um, oh, gotcha. Okay. Okay. There yeah. Because this is very, uh, places around here that we could do it. Well, we could put it right here. We could put it like right on this as if it's going well, to the turntable. Yeah. Don't fall down there. <laughs> Yeah, this bridge has yet to be I gotta pay attention. Completed. Well see, we can have um the engine and tender here and the I'm I've designed rolling stock if you want rolling stock and they could oh, be yeah, going be cool. over the bridge. That so would be cool. I've got coal wagons and goods fans. Oh wow. That and would I be can amazing. I can show you how to make those and then you can make as many of those as you want. You can make this train as long as you want. That would be super cool. Yeah. That would okay. be great. I love it. All right. So you want it coming in here to the turntable? I think, I mean, this is the, this is the yeah. strays part. I kind of went up here by the factory. I thought that uh, just cause yeah. I thought it would look cool from down there. If you saw it. Yeah, it would. Well, there's actually nine places um, in this area that it could go, but coming into your factory, 
That would be kind of nice. Okay. Well, let's do it. Well, why don't we do a cut here and get some stuff ready and then we'll come back sure. and, and uh, show some of the work. Cool. Okay. Well, so we've done some work here. Well, we, I mean, you, you've done some work. No. I just stand around. I'm just, I'm jumping. This is what, I'm just jumping don't, around you. And don't stuff. listen to him. What rubbish. I built one half, he built the other. So we've got, <laughs> we've got the wheels and the undercarriage done. And if I get too boring with this, just hit me fix. Okay. So oh, no, no, I would never. This is why it's called a 422 because you've got four wheels at the front that are one size and then you've got two and then you've got two. <laughs> and that's how they classify okay. that's how they classify English engines. I, I don't know if American you know, ones are classified the same they might be, but English is what I do, so we should have done a 412. Why? Because that's my because that's my Oh, cuz you're name. fixed 412. We should have <laughs> See, that you, would have been really good. You can muck around and change that. I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> we'll just, we'll just, it just have one wheel on one side. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can take one out if you want. It had an accident. And the other reason okay, that yeah. the Sterling's called a single is because this big wheel in the middle, which is a half wheel because that's how Minecraft rolls, um, that's a drive wheel and it's only one drive wheel and a lot of others have more than one drive wheel. Good idea. And yeah? it's called a okay. Sterling because the guy who designed it was called Sterling. <laughs> okay, nice, nice. So that's it. First ran in 1870. But this is just the undercarriage. <laughs> We're not going to let you poodle around just in this. That's right. That's right. There's there's a lot more train coming. There so is. why don't we do some more building? Yep. Uh, and then then we'll uh, we'll come back and show uh, more of the uh, the upper part. This is sure. this is the building material. Wait till you see it. It's so beautiful. Okay. Yeah, oh, I love it. <laughs> okay. You know, I almost wonder, I'm just looking at it now as it develops, yeah. I almost wonder how and, how andesite wheels would look. Uh, we can try them because my problem with the black is it blends in with the rails. Exactly, yeah. What does your andesite look like? It's like a dark grey. Well, we in can fact, try it because we can make, make the right shapes out of it. Well, this is a nice thing to work on because with this block, you can count, you can definitely see where blocks begin. Oh yeah. The the netherrack is is really difficult like that. Yeah, it is. I mean, it looks spectacular. I love the black netherrack, and I'm like, I want this. I seriously want this. But then counting one, two, three, four, and okay, I'll just fall off it. again. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have scaffolding now, so now it's not quite. We a do. Thing. You're gonna hate me. I know exactly what's wrong. I don't think I'm going to hate you. What's wrong? We have to shift everything forward one. <laughs> forward one? Well, to a certain point. I'll just do it. Don't worry. I just suddenly realized why the count was out and why it looks stubby. That's it. Just stops there? Yep. Just stops there because it's connecting in here Good. to the drive wheel. Two, four, six. And it shouldn't be shiny, but, you know, Minecraft. Well, we've gone and built basically the whole thing off camera. <laughs> just like yeah. I said, I was going to forget and do. Uh, we just got to chatting and talking. And, and sure enough, look at this thing. Is that thing not amazing? It's amazing. This train it's, is unbelievable. You are a master. It's a monster. No. <laughs> I muddle along, but you, thank you. You are a master. I love it so much. It's I'm so cool. So what? Glad. So we decided to trade out the uh, wheels. It was mm. originally black netherrack, which is probably more accurate. It probably should be black, but they really blended in like with the rails because I uh, I chose to do black netherrack rails. So we trade these out for him. I think it does help. But the, um, the black was a compromise because on the engine, they were actually painted green. But if you do green prismarine wheels with a green prismarine body, it's just, oh, wow. okay. it's just this yeah. blob. <laughs> Right, right, right. Because yeah, we don't have the fine fun. black rims around it that real engines have. So the andesite's a really good compromise. I like it. Yeah, I, I think it I think it works well. And, and the, the regular, like, cobbly... By the way, this is recolored by Klaptos. Uh If you notice, if you're like, hey, that andesite looks a little darker, we're, we're testing it. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm probably... I'm seeing it darker than you are currently because I oh, okay. didn't send out the pack to everybody. It's just a little mm -hmm. bit. It's just a tiny bit darker, but... Um, Klautos has been working in an underground crypt for like the last year here. It's, it's, <laughs> it's epically massive. I mean, it's so big. And, um, and he, 
when you're in really low light level, the, the anisate that we have is not that different from cobblestone. It's uh -huh. pretty close. Where up in the light, there's a nice difference. So this is kind of a compromise that we're looking at right now. I like it, though. Okay. It's not... Uh, whenever you see it, uh, probably when my video comes out, uh, yeah. you'll be like, oh, well, but yeah, that's, it's it's just a little bit darker, but it's nice. Oh, so cool. what are these end rods? Maybe you could tell the people. All right. They're connecting rods to connect the drive wheel. Yes, yes, yes. So the idea is this is the drive wheel, and it's connected to the piston here. So it goes round, and it drives everything. What arrant nonsense. Let's get this right. Firebox, boiler, water goes in the boiler, coal goes in the firebox, fire heats up water, makes steam. Pistons, there are pistons in there, just believe me. Pistons driven by steam, backwards and forwards, connected to connecting rods, connecting rods connected to drive wheels. Pistons pump, move connecting rods, Connecting rods move drive wheels, which drive the engine forwards or backwards. That's why they're called drive wheels. I know this stuff. What's wrong with me? Ah! Because it's a drive yeah, wheel. Awesome. Woohoo! <laughs> it, awesome. it looks awesome. It's just so good. Look, look uh, the tender um, yeah. back here in the back. That's one of the few things I do know of trains because of uh, all of how much time I, I spend watching Thomas and friends. So it's a tender. It's not a coal car. No, and, uh, it's not a coal car. It's a tender. Car. Nope. Yeah. It, this is super cool. And super because, cool. I just feel like the whole place comes alive. And because Thomas is a tank engine, he's got a built in tender. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There are monsters. For sure. Oh, I thought maybe I walked away far enough. It, this whole, this may not surprise you at all. And everything underneath is not lit up <laughs> because of course it's not. Okay. You need to put your bed up inside. You've got all that lovely area up there you've built. I went and had a squiz. <laughs> okay, here, let's move it. Mm. That's better. I, how nice is it, by the way, 115, where you can set your respawn during the day? Uh, I wouldn't know. <laughs> We're still on 114.4. <laughs> Oh, it's so great. Like, you can just click it that bed and then boom, respawn set. Such a fabulous idea. When you name the railway, you'll have to make banners. Yeah. Oh, yeah. To hang I did on see the, those on your video. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, you just put the banners on the sides of the tender, not on the engine. Right. Got it. Well, I think... Uh, it's about time for, for old old man fix here to go to bed because it's almost it's crawling up near two o'clock oh, in the no. morning. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, which no, no, no. I'm a musician, you know. I'm a musician, so I'm always up this late. But we're getting to the point where I'm not going to be up that much later. So, okay. so listen. I want to say thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming over here and helping me build this amazing uh, thing, guys. If you want to see this and not only see all these amazing trains both on the Alpha Craft server and most importantly for a lot of you is tutorials um, mm. on Drama Smith Dreams. It's youtube.com slash Drama Smith Dreams. It'll be linked in the description. Guys, go subscribe. I, I, I have never led you astray yet. Go subscribe. You'll come back and say, hey, fix. Thank you for pointing me this way because, wow, great videos, entertaining, fun, awesome. And, uh, yeah, I, I know uh, I don't miss it, so so neither should you. Well, thank you so much, uh, Drama. Thank you so much for coming Thank you. Over. I'm blushing so much. And to my people watching, if you have not watched Realm of Vastin, if you have not watched Fix, you have to go do it. It's amazing. He is an my amazing builder. Well. He's an amazing storyteller. And he has got an amazing team of people. There is a wealth of stupendous videos there for you. Feast upon them. Well, that that is true. We the 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 team. I'll I'll I'll, I'll give you the. the that built here is absolutely amazing. Uh, you know, if you're ever looking for a place to build, you know, maybe uh, you can just split some of your time over here. Just saying, just throwing it out there. That's all. Just saying. Wow. Thank you so much. <laughs> I will you. see you all next episode from the realm of vast. And please go subscribe to my friend and uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks everybody. Thanks.
That was a huge amount of fun. I can't thank Fix enough for asking me to come on and do this with him. And I can't wait to see what they call the railway. Um, so they can put banners on that and we can see it truly finished. After poor Fix went to bed, because, wow, that was late, I made a couple of cars. They're missing some bits because I ran out of stuff. <laughs> Need a couple of extra hoppers on each wheel. But we have a little goods van. And I've got the door open on this side. And we've got a little coal wagon. <laughs> Probably needs a brake van on the end as well. But I'm kind of running out of time too. <laughs> but... Yeah, I really enjoyed this. I had such a lot of fun designing this. And I had a huge amount of fun building this. Seriously, guys, Realm of Vaston is the most incredible place. You have to go over and check out Fix's channel and check out the channels of the other builders. It's just so inspiring. I mean, look at that. Wow. And look at this. So I'm going to stop burbling now. And I'm going to leave you to it. Uh, there'll be some cards on the end screen to... Maybe an engine tutorial, not for this engine. Which is missing two blocks. Let's fix that. Let's just fix that. We need one of those. And we need one of these. And that's dreadful. There we are. Let's have a look. That is much better. Now there's not a hole in the side. Okay, so there'll be an end card on the screen, probably with a link to um, a different steam engine or rolling stock. Um, and on that note, I'm going to say bye.